Welcome to the Great HR How To Video Series. In this video, we will talk about how to process resettlement for resigned employees from your Great HR account. Often the admin may want to make changes to the completed settlements of employees who are no longer with the organization. The reason can be errors during the settlement period or incorrect information being updated at the time of full and final settlement. The resettlement page under the payroll input section will help the admin to correct errors that may have occurred during the final settlement and process the resettlement for an employee. The page displays the employees whose resettlement has been completed in the current payroll month. Now, click on the resettle employee button to start the process. You can initiate the resettlement only for those employees whose final settlements have been completed in the previous payroll month. So, the Settle Employee drop-down will display only those for whom the resettlement was done earlier. Once you select the employee name from the drop-down list, you can view the employee settlement info and access to review the settlement payslips. Now, enter the resettlement date and the reason and save the changes. Please note that once you update the details on this page, you need to manually enter or override the resettlement amount under the payroll input salary tab since the employee salary would have been automatically removed when you completed the employee's final settlement earlier now search for the employee by selecting the resigned employee section by selecting the right components click on add row enter the amount manually Enter the details and save the changes. Now, click on the process payroll button to process the employee's salary. You can also download the resettlement payslip of the employee from this page and the resettled employee information will be available in the current month's payroll statement. After verifying the details, you can pay the employee by cash or check. You can also complete the resettlement of your employees in bulk using the Excel import feature. Use the Resettlement Importer template to upload the resettlement information of the employees. Once done, use the Importer template bulk salary information of the employees to upload the salary details in the system and process the salary. Hope you have had a thorough understanding of how the resettlement process is carried out for your resigned employees. With that, we come to an end. Thank you for watching the Great HR How To Video Series.